Well, it's been an amazing day so far. I really hope that you are taking advantage of the time you have, just a few minutes right in this moment, to think through and to be charged to pray. And then however long you have opportunity to pray today, to spend this day of prayer in prayer. That right now we want to pray for families. Uh, we ultimately know that right now families are struggling. There's so many reasons between the chaos of, of um, work and health with our country in terms of the pandemic, for economic issues, whether they're experiencing them or whether they're dealing with the job crisis right now and they're experiencing it and they will be experiencing it in the future. Um, we know that there's tons of things that are causing massive amounts of stress on families. And we know right now, many families are so consumed by the things going on in their life, so consumed by the circumstances that they are in fact losing touch and losing focus on who their focus should be on. So again, I'm going to engage a, a, an old Puritan prayer. This is taken from the Valley of Vision, a collection of Puritan prayers and devotions, to pray for our families. I just want you to hear these words. You can read them. I'll put them in the notes as well. O Sovereign Lord, Thou art the special Father of those who know, love, and honor Thee, who find Thy yoke easy and Thy burden light, and thy work honorable, and thy commands glorious. Help me to hate and forsake every false way, to be attentive to my condition and character, to bridle my tongue, to keep my heart with all diligence, to watch and pray against temptation, to mortify sin, and to be concerned for the salvation of others. Let those that are united to me in tender ties, speaking of family, be precious in thy sight and devoted to thy glory. Sanctify and prosper my domestic devotion, instruction, discipline, example, that my house may be a nursery for heaven, my church the garden of the Lord, and enriched with trees of righteousness of thy planting for thy glory. Let not those in my family who are amiable, moral, attractive, fall short of heaven at last. Grant that the promising appearances of a tender conscience, soft heart, the alarms and delight of thy word be not blotted out, but bring forth judgment unto victory to all whom I love. However you need to do it today, I'm just wanting you to pray for your family. Pray for families that you know. Pray for families that you don't know, but you know are struggling at this time. And I want you to just intercede for you and on their behalf and pray for families.